can a pool pump be too powerful or too powerful for my pool? The answer to this, surprisingly, is yeah, it, it actually can, and it's super common. I mean, I wish it weren't common at all, but as a matter of fact, I would say possibly even the majority of swimming pools out there might have a filtration pump that's too powerful. There's a lot of moving parts in this equation, but what we need to consider is the number of suction and return lines that this pool has and the size of those pipes. The size is a really, really important distinction. The reason why is there are standards that are established for things like entrapment hazards in swimming pools. And while they're not really something that's represented well for residential swimming pools, universally these flow dynamics do apply. Something like six feet per second of flow velocity in any suction line of a swimming pool. You should never have more than six feet per second of a suction line velocity. More than that could pose an entrapment hazard. And the numbers are pretty small. So one and a half inch PVC pipe represents about 38 gallons per minute at six feet per second of flow velocity. And two inch PVC represents about 65 gallons per minute of flow for six feet per second. And you're thinking, well, how does this, you know, how does this relate to my pool? So here's how it relates to your pool. There's so many filtration pumps out there that, that are one and a half horsepower, two horsepower, or even three horsepower. Like the most popular ones are three horsepower. So there's a lot of them out there. And in theory, you're supposed to use those on swimming pools that have a lot of pipes or pipes a lot bigger than two inch pipes. But really, that's not where you see them. You kind of just see those pumps used everywhere. So there's a lot of times where you've got these great big three horsepower filtration pumps, and you might have one two inch suction line or two two inch suction lines or even three two inch suction lines, and that ain't enough. You will easily recognize or you easily achieve 120 gallons per minute of flow through a single two inch PVC line. And when you put a three horsepower pump on it, you're probably even going to exceed that number a little bit. And that would be way too much. As I was saying earlier, about 65 gallons per minute is the maximum that you would want to have for any suction line in a swimming pool. So if you put a three horsepower pump on a single two inch PVC line, yeah, you're, you almost certainly have an entrapment hazard in your swimming pool, and that pump is almost certainly too large. And this is just talking about the safety aspect, because that's the most important part. But also there's other stuff, like you can totally overdrive your filter with one of these very powerful um, three horsepower pumps, two and three horsepower pumps. By and large, the optimum size pump or motor for a filtration system of a swimming pool is about three quarters of a horsepower. Most people don't realize that. They kind of shop according to the Tim the Toolman Taylor approach, which is bigger is better. And that's definitely not the case when it comes to filtration pumps for your swimming pool. Kind of smaller is better. But the market's not set up for that. Most brands kind of sell a line of pumps that are all almost too large for the average swimming pool. So yeah, you kind of have to work pretty hard to end up with one that's not too large. And this is a very important consideration, not just from efficiency or longevity from of your equipment, but most of all, safety. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.